Welcome to pause for prayer. Today's verse of the day is Proverbs 12:25 KJV. Heaviness in the heart of man maketh it stoop, but a good word maketh it glad. This ends the reading of God's holy word. Shall we pray? Father, we are living in a time where our hearts are heavy because of all the things that are going on around us. Give us to remember that our hearts are not broken in a way that cannot be fixed. Father, give us to realize that our intrusive thoughts are fed by an anxious spirit that we not give into the things that come to try us or cause our hearts to be heavy. Give us to trust you even in this hard thing that someone is going through that is causing them to want to throw in the towel that they not faint in the day of adversity. Give us to realize that you shook things up in the earth that we not lean to idols, people, or the other things that will ultimately fail us. Father, give us to realize that you are the only lasting pathway that we lean not to our own understanding, trying to fix things ourselves rather than depending totally on you. Father, give us to realize that when Jesus saved us, he also offered us his peace in our daily lives, that we not be content living in turmoil and confusion. thinking it's your will for us to suffer give us to realize that some of the things that are making is us heavy are doing so because we refuse to surrender our will to yours give us to realize that when we walk in total obedience that you will once again cause things to fall in line for us give us to realize that our obedience to you is going to require us to tell people the truth about those things that are putting them or their blessings in jeopardy give us to realize that to enter into your rest on this side of heaven we must submit give us to realize that after we submit to you will you will allow us to walk in dominion through the power of the holy ghost give us to realize that we will also find peace in our trust that we take our hands and mouths off stuff things and people realizing that you will cause everything to work out just fine give us to realize that if we are to mature spiritually that we must trust you during these times when everything seems unstable father pull us out of this endless cycle of worry and doubt that the devil not continue to take advantage of us because he knows that's where we are weak in the faith father set a hedge around those weak points that we may have the opportunity to come out victorious cause the enemy to no longer to be successful in frustrating us or defeating us with the same things over and over again give us the victory in the areas where the enemy has been tempting us or causing us to forfeit those blessings that you were getting ready to give us father look on lydia today you know what's in her heart bind the hands and the work of the devil that seeks to frustrate and distract her from completing the assignment that you had given to her charge father open up streams of income for the church the evangelistic association as well as her personal finances father in jesus name cause her never to be broke another day in her life in jesus name cause her to be a kingdom entrepreneur that she may bless and employ others in jesus name father you know what each person needs that is listening to this prayer father supply those needs today according to your riches and glory by christ jesus cause our expectation to never be cut short by the tricks and tactics of the enemy in Jesus name father you promised that for our shame that we would have double father we ask that on today before the sun goes down that you open the windows of heaven and pour down a blessing that we do not have room to contain father restore our joy the joy of our salvation that we no longer appear to the world as bitter give us to rejoice and be glad fill us to overflowing with fresh power in the holy ghost in jesus name amen we thank you for listening to today's edition of pause for prayer sponsored by the holy place church join us again tomorrow at 7am on behalf of our lead servant lydia have an awesome day